Cheers. Today I wanted to kind of take you guys through my self-care routine. Um, I put a poll up on my Instagram asking you guys if you wanted to see my self-care routine or like a mini vlog of things that I was doing this week. And it seemed like you guys were leaning more towards this video, which came at a perfect time because today I kind of have like a little bit of a headache. I was out late with some friends last night and I could just use some, some me time today. So yeah, just come with me as I do some things that help me feel a little bit more like calm or myself or if I'm like really stressed, this is what I will typically do to kind of feel a little bit better. And um, yeah, so number one is I clean my space. If it's feeling like cluttered or just like it needs a little refresh. And I have so much laundry <laughs> to put away. That's all clean laundry right there. So I have to go put that away and then I'll probably just clean up a little bit and then um, we'll take it from there. I lit a candle. <laughs> um, I feel like whenever my space is clean, my head is a little bit more clear and like, I feel like my space, if it's cluttered, typically my brain and like my thoughts are cluttered as well and it just makes me like stressed and anxious. So that always makes me feel a lot better whenever I like clean up a little bit. I'll open up our French doors just to get some like fresh air kind of like circulate the house a little bit, flush out the bad vibes, all of those things. And then usually whenever I'm doing like a me day or just needing like some extra love, I always drink like so much tea all day long just because it's like a cuddle in a cup and it makes me feel cozy and warm. So the ones that I'm drinking right now are it's a Tulsi lemon ginger and just like a plain green tea. And then I have some that I'll show you guys later that's like nighttime tea that's really great for helping you kind of like sleep better too. But I actually just got back from a walk and that's another thing that I really like to do, especially if I'm really stressed. I feel like walking just really like helps my brain kind of like quiet down or get the thoughts out of my head and kind of be able to like work through things. And it's a great workout and it's very gentle on your body. So I always make sure to go for a walk. I try to go for a walk every single day, but specifically on days like this where I just feel like I need some extra me time or just some alone time, I always go for a walk and I try to have it be around a 10,000 step walk just because I feel like I get like a really good workout, I get time outside, it's just, it's just a good thing to do. So now I'm going to go take a shower, which taking like a super hot warm shower always makes me feel better. <laughs> Okay, and on self-care days, I like to go all out on my shower. I actually, I washed my hair last night, so I don't need to wash my hair, but I would typically like wash my hair, do like a hair mask, all of that stuff. And um, I'm going to exfoliate. I have this, this is the Luna Bronze. I don't know, it's like an exfoliating mitt thing that you take into the shower with you. And I'm just gonna like exfoliate my shoulders, my arms, my legs, really get in there, get all of that dead skin out. Afterward, I'm gonna self tan because self tanning always makes me feel a little bit better about myself and I just feel cuter when I'm tan. So it kind of just helps everything. So this is the Loving Tan Delu Deluxe Bronzing Mousse and this is the Ultra Dark color so I'll just put a little bit of this on after my shower and yeah I like to go all out like I have candles lit over here it's 
all about the vibes. I've got my tea. And oh, I'm gonna do a face mask as well. Let me show you guys the mask that I'm gonna use. This is the Naturopathica Sweet Cherry Brightening Enzyme Peel. I think I might have talked about this in my skincare video, but I finally got a restock of it. It smells so, so freaking good. It smells like a cherry pie. And um, it's just like an exfoliating mask. It's very gentle just because it's an enzyme mask. Yeah, I like to do like a full body exfoliation, self tan, and then just like really go hard on my skincare as well. And um, yeah, so I'm gonna go shower. All right, I just got out of the shower. I have my cozy robe and my cute little teddy bear headband that keeps my hair out of my face. I'm gonna wash my face right now with my sea buckthorn oil. And then I decided since I'm going all out anyway, I'm going to shave my face <laughs> with a tinkle razor. Um, I don't do this very often. And I feel like if I'm gonna do an exfoliating face mask, might as well exfoliate and get the hairs out so I can exfoliate better. I don't know. little bits of cherry all over in it. I tinkled my face and I immediately applied the mask and it stung a little bit just because I had the extra exfoliation of the tinkle razor but it feels so good and it feels like it's doing what it's supposed to do. I'm gonna let this sit while I apply my self tan and um, I will see you guys after. This face mask is the most horrifying looking thing I've ever put on my face. But I just put on my self tan. I'm letting my face mask sit for just a little bit longer. It says like 10 to 15 minutes and it's only been like seven or eight. Um, but I wanted to show you guys my favorite tea for nighttime that, oof, it gives you like the best sleep of your entire life. So this is the tea. I like to do both of them in one cup. This is the Nighty Night Extra by Traditional Medic Medicinals. And this is the cup of calm. So there's lavender, mint, and then this one's valerian. Valerian is really, really great for um, like sleep and assisting in getting you like a very like restful sleep. And then this one's lavender, mint, and it's just heavenly. And then, so I'll typically drink that at night for my self-care days. And then I will always have my magnesium from Moon Juice, which just chills you out and helps you get a really good night's sleep and just like refreshes you. And sleep is my everything, especially when I'm feeling stressed or just like icky or just not myself. So I will always, always have some of that tea at night whenever I have my self-care days, just to kind of like wind down while I'm watching a show or I started doing a gratitude journal this year and I stopped doing it for a while and I've just picked it up again within the last month or so. Whenever I'm feeling like stressed out about life or anything or just uneasy, I will start my gratitude journal again and what I do is I make a Google Doc in just online and I named it gratitude journal and it's just like a continuous journal that I enter just things that I'm grateful for that day. And I try to do like upwards, this is a lot, I try to do upwards of 111 whenever I'm feeling really stressed or just like icky because it really, really, really just like gets me in a space of gratitude and like seriously, it just makes my entire day so much better. It's just really like relaxing while I do it because I'll always put on my noise canceling headphones, listen to some really like pretty like meditation music and just like list out things that I'm grateful for that day. Um, and it's really hard to do when you're not feeling your best or you're feeling really stressed out. And that is the best time to do it because every time that I've forced myself to do it, I feel so much better after. I'm in so much more of like a positive attitude and mental state. I love it so much. So this is my self-care routine. I'm gonna go wash off my face here in a little bit put on all of my moisturizers, 
really like massage my face, give myself just some extra pampering. And I'm gonna drink a lot of water and make myself a really yummy dinner. I don't know, I'm thinking like pasta or something, I'm not sure. If I mentioned any products in this video, I will link them down below for you guys. And I will also link below a meditation soundtrack that I listened to while writing in my gratitude journal. I really hope some of these practices might help you guys give yourselves a little extra love. And I'm hoping that this kind of just like helps you guys realize that self-care is not just skincare and fun products because that's totally fine and that can totally be what it is for you. But I also think a lot of it is just a mental like check, making sure that you're taking time for yourself, doing things for yourself that are very special and bringing you back to just kind of like a calm space if that makes sense. I just can't get over how horrifying this face mask is. It looks like I have blood all over my face. It looks like I got that vampire facial thing or whatever, but it smells amazing. I literally smell like cherry pie and I love it so much. Thanks for watching. I love you guys. I'm gonna go wash my face and eat some pasta and hang out and chill and I will see you next week. Bye-bye.